Hi ladies, it's Karen. Happy Valentine's Day. And first, before I continue, I wanna show Wanda. She's Boxy Bell here on YouTube. She had sent me this cute little cat bracelet in my Valentine's rack. So sweet, and she said I could take it apart, but there's no way I'm wearing it. <laughs> so thank you so much, Wanda. Anyway, um, I also received a package from Elizabeth. Right here, this is from Elizabeth. She's BD Bomb Bomb here on YouTube. Well, BD Bomb Bomb One here on YouTube. Now, her and I um, were talking, and um, and I think I think I'm the one who suggested doing a swap of some sort. And um, she had suggested maybe a mini album swap. And then I thought, well, that's. Kind of, I don't know if I would have time, you know, because of the other projects that I knew that I had wanted to get get through for Valentine's and everything. This was last month. And um, so anyway, we decided on making it a tax, a tax swap. And then I thought it would be fun, and I wish I'd thought about it beforehand, but I thought it would have been fun to make it a tax swap, but also an embellishment swap, you know, like make six handmade embellishments, whether it's, you know, bottle caps or art tiles or stick pins or flowers, you know, or charms or, or whatever, or altered clothes pins. So, um, you know, however, however you wanted to, to work it out, you know, we do swap handmade embellishments. Well, I am telling you what, if I had thought twice, I would have realized just how intimidated I was of Elizabeth's work. She does the most meticulous, beautiful, shabby chic projects. And you know me, I'm not, I'm not very girly in my work. I mean, I'm more vintage shabby, I guess, but um, you know, I, I don't think I, I'm as meticulous as, as, Elizabeth is, and at, at any rate, at any rate, you know, immediately I, I thought, oh my God, she said yes, now what do I do? <laughs> and, um, and I saw her video the other day, it was late last night, and I saw her video of the things that she had created for me, the things that are in this box, and I thought, oh my God, she created such gorgeous things, I can't believe I sent her what I sent her. <laughs> So, um, anyway, I am very excited to get your package, Elizabeth. Hi, Elizabeth. So, um, I just want you to know how completely intimidated I was. <laughs> so, um, at any rate, let's dig into this box because, um, I'm very excited. And, excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my throat is dry. So, um... So yeah, let's do this. <laughs> and um, it's very like dark and gray out, you know, because it's a rainy day here in Florida, like I said before. So there's not a lot of light. So I'm doing this right up against our sliding glass door. Ooh, look at the shimmery happy paper. That says Valentine's. Oh my God, see, this is what I'm talking about, ladies. Right off the bat. Right off the bat, it's like gorgeousness. <laughs> oh my gosh, Elizabeth. See, and, and she had mentioned, and I had no idea, but she had mentioned that she's not comfortable doing cards. And I couldn't believe it because she makes gorgeous cards. They're always so, like I said, meticulous and neat. She does neat work, you know what I mean? Just beautiful. This card is gorgeous, Elizabeth. Oh my gosh. She just posted the video on this card the other day. Isn't that gorgeous? With the lace up here. Is that lace? Yeah, she did a layer of lace. She said this is the first time she's ever did any layering in her cards and it came out so beautiful. This doily um, cluster of flowers and the stick pin there. It's just beautiful. I just love this card. And, and I thought it was funny because I'm not comfortable doing cards either, except the only difference is it, it's obvious in the cards that I create. 
The cards that she creates, you couldn't tell that she's not comfortable doing cards. Aww. Oh, thank you so much. You're an inspiration to me, Elizabeth. Oh my gosh. I, I just love your work. So let's open this first. And I've been waiting on this box. We decided Valentine's Day that we it would be romance themed and that we would give ourselves a Valentine's Day deadline. And Elizabeth, if you don't get your package today, I'm hoping that you get it tomorrow because um, it's en route. <laughs> it's her tag. Oh my gosh. Yeah, see, you can't tell on a video. This is so much more beautiful in person. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? The trim she has, and this, I don't know, I think she stickled around this flower here to make it come out like that. And she did the, the beads, <clears throat> excuse me. Yeah, it's, it's the bead on a roll, I think it is. And it's in that purple, perfect oval shape. It's just gorgeous. Oh, I love this. Thank you so much. Oh, this is gorgeous. Definitely going up in my room. Oh my gosh, she sent me chocolates. Thank you so much. Oh, what a treat. Thank you. It's another red bag. I'm so glad you sent me chocolates. It's her flowers, I think. Elizabeth, wait till you see my flowers. They're just sad. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, look at this one. These are beautiful. Oh, these are going to go on an altered project because of the size or else on an altered canvas because they're so huge. I love that one. Look at this one. Just beautiful. And look. They're a good size. Oh, look at this one. See, that's, I, I don't think to layer. See, she's got different layers. It's beautiful. I, I, I'm gonna really give it another try, these fabric flowers. Oh, this one's my favorite. This lace is so soft. And look at the um, flower center. Isn't that cute? I love that one. They're gorgeous, Elizabeth. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna try really hard not to hoard these. I'm gonna try really hard to find a project for them. Aww. Look at this bag. Isn't that cute? Oh, it's so pretty. Everything's so pretty. What a treat to get some of your handmade goodies. I'm telling you what. I've been watching you for the longest time. <gasps> oh my gosh, Elizabeth. Look how she packaged this. Oh, aren't you clever. First, here's the bottle top. Or no, um, yeah, bottle cap. And look, she not only did she alter this bottle cap, see she did the outside of the cap, with the glossy accents and everything, but then she went around and put that, um, oh, what do you call that? That blingy trim type of stuff all the way around that. See, I never would have thought of that, but that is a great idea, and I'm definitely gonna try that. It's so cute, she stamped the card and everything. She put it right on that card. And look how she did this. She sent me this chunky, she made this chunky charm. And you can tell she's a jewelry maker because her jump rings and everything, just so meticulous. And I have such a hard time with that. But look at, there's a stick pin. Isn't that beautiful? And then the chunky charm. 
Look at all the different hearts in there. That heart bead from Hobby Lobby and the, these other uh, metallic type charms. Oh, that's gorgeous. I need to make a Valentine's mini album so I can hang that off of there. Oh, and she put it, she used the, um, what do you call this, spring clasp for it. So that's great. I won't have a hard time. Oh, this is just beautiful. Elizabeth, you do such gorgeous work. You can tell that she was a jewelry maker because it's all just perfect. <laughs> That's why I was so embarrassed sending her my the charms that I created. I mean, I have a hard time with the jump rings and stuff. I love the bag. This is so great. Oh, look at this. Her art tiles are so terrific. Yeah, I'm going to have to make a mini album so I can just use it to use her embellishments. Look at these art tiles. I love the chandelier one. Aren't they gorgeous? She did some stamping and she followed um, Live Art Now, I believe, her tutorial on how to do these. Just beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I love these, Elizabeth. I'm definitely going to use these up, too. I won't hoard these. I'll use them. I just love these. They're so cute. You did a great job. She made me, or not made me, she altered in a balsa box for me. Elizabeth, thank you so much. Is this the tea time paper? Oh my gosh. Look how beautiful. Oh, I love this. Thank you so much. And see, her stick pin is just, it's just so perfect, you know? It's dainty and perfect and... They're like perfectly, um, not symmetrical, but the beads are perfectly placed, you know. Oh my gosh, look how she put her, it's not a, it's a stick pin thing. That's terrific. Thank you so much. I love that. Look at her pins. I don't even want to take them out. Look. Isn't that gorgeous? And look at this one. I love these beads. I have some of these beads too. I think these are the Jesse James ones from um, Joann's. Aren't those beautiful? And when they had that sale a few weeks back, we all bought a boatload of them. I know I did. <laughs> I love how you did this. This is a fantastic idea. Look at that one. That'll go on a nice, sweet little project. I'll try real hard to use these, Elizabeth. <laughs> I know you made them for me to use, but boy, oh boy. I think they're just so pretty all by themselves, you know? Oh, they're gorgeous. You made so many. You didn't have to make so many. I really appreciate it, though. Look at these. Oh, my gosh. Look at this one, how delicate this one is. It's so Victorian looking. Doesn't it remind me, remind you of like a perfume bottle, the shapes on that? So classy and pretty. That's what your, that's what your, um, your crafts remind me of. They're, they're just so classy, the things that you create, you know? This is so sweet. Thank you so much for doing that for me. I love it. How cute is that? And see the painting on the side. And look at this button. I think it's a button in the front there. No, oh, it's just perfect. You do such perfect, just so pretty. Your stuff is always so pretty and girly. It's your altered clothespin. See, it never occurred to me to alter one of the bigger clothespins or else I totally would have done that. This is so sweet. I saw it on her video and I couldn't, I couldn't wait to get it. It's one of the large ones. And she, see this, see the music notes um, on there? She stamped that on there. Look how perfect it came out. 
When she first started showing it, I thought it was paper. I thought it was music note paper. And then look at the front with the stick pin. Oh, so great. I love this. This is so sweet. And see, it says love. Oh, it's just so perfectly feminine. I'm going to have to put all these things on it on my shelf just all together, you know. Oh, they're perfect. I just love it. Thank you, Elizabeth. I'm just so tickled to have some of your work, which is why I wanted to swap in the first place. <laughs> and then she sent a few things unnecessary. Very much appreciated. Such a sweetheart. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. <gasps> what did you do? Look, oh, these are left over. Remember when she had her store? Oh, I love these. These are great. These are gonna be great for flower centers. You know, my mom might even like to wear those. <laughs> did I miss anything else in there? Oh my gosh. Oh, Elizabeth, thank you. Look at that bobble. That's an artichoke waiting to happen right there. That's fantastic. I love it. Look at this one. Oh, my gosh. Look at that mirror. Oh, thank you so much. These charms are fantastic. I love the mirror. Thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. I really appreciate it, though. What is this? This is really heavy. <gasps> no, you didn't. Elizabeth. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much. She sent me. These are the um, really good ones. <laughs> the Jesse James beads. Look. She sent me that one, and I'm really excited about this one. Aren't those pretty? Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Elizabeth, and look at this one. I don't have this one. Look at the colors. It's like a pink fuchsia purple. I love the different shapes of beads on these ones because these are these are the kind of beads that you want to gather together to try to create an artichoke type deal. Look at that one with all the beads on there. Oh, Elizabeth, thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much. I don't know what to say. What a treat. Thank you. These, these are kind of expensive, and I really appreciate it. Alter me. Oh, it's doodads. Look at this. I won't take them out because they're all so nice in this container. But look, I'm going to have to alter this container. Look at all that gorgeousness in there. The, the little bows and the, um, the blings and the buttons. Look at all, everything. Oh, my gosh. This is going to be fun. When I'm done with the video, I'm dumping this out on the table and I'm going through it. Thank you so much. <clears throat> You're such a sweetheart. Another bag. I'm sorry, ladies. I know this is going to be a long video, but I'm taking my time because this is the first time I've ever gotten happy mail from, from um, Elizabeth. What's this? Something pretty. Huh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, I love that. That's terrific. Oh, I love that. It's like a boutonniere. That's going to be so nice on a box or a frame. Oh my God, Elizabeth. You are so thoughtful. Look at this. These are the ceramic roses with the little ribbon roses inside. She sent me a whole bunch of those. Oh my gosh. And these, aren't those beautiful? That's gonna be great on an altar project as well. And look at this one. Oh, that's beautiful. I love that color. And look at the mint color on this one. 
Look at the mint color. That divine, Prima divine paper that's coming out from Prima, I think it's got some mint, mint colors in there, so that would be really nice. I'm already dreaming about the new Prima. <laughs> Look at this one with the little baby's breath in it. Can you see that? Oh, man. This is going to be so fun to work with these sprays. And look at, she sent me an acrylic, pink acrylic spray. Isn't that sweet? Thank you so much, Elizabeth. I'll put that back after and look. It's one of the um, note card sets. It's got the um, postal and then the floral. Isn't that cute? I love that. Thank you. Oh, it's the damask one. Was this the one from the holidays? See, you can't tell this is a Christmas stamp. It just looks damask to me. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. I love this stamp. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you spoiled me. She sent me some of the new recollections. Oh, I, I didn't pick these up and I, don't, I didn't get these either. I don't have this color. I have this in the copper. So this is a treat in the copper and browns. <gasps> Look at this. She sent me the washi tape with the scissors and buttons. I am so excited. Oh my gosh. Elizabeth, you're too sweet. I love these. I, ne I never got these either. Thank you. Oh, and these little note cards. I have these as well, but you can always use more. These are perfect for journaling spots, like in the mini albums and stuff. She sent me an initial. That's me, K for Karen. Oh, look at this heart doily one. I didn't get this one either. I think this is from the dollar spot. I love that. That's gonna be nice embossed. Elizabeth, are you serious? Oh my gosh. Look at this. It's from Stamper's Best. Oh, I can't wait to play with this. Oh my gosh. With the dress form and the Eiffel Tower. And the other ones. Oh, these are going to be great for um, art tiles. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, you didn't. It's a Spellbinders. It's the window. Window one. Oh, my gosh, Elizabeth. Thank you so much. You are so generous. Oh, I can't wait to play with this. How cool is that? I don't want my camera to die, so I'm trying to hurry, but I don't want to hurry. Look at the ribbon roses. And then she sent me some doilies. Look at that. I love this. This is a square one. I've never seen a square one before. Is that from Julie the Paper Bag Lady? And then she sent me the Teresa Collins. Um, or it's actually my mind's eye or whatever, the Christmas paper. And then she said, alter me. And this is one of those fans. You know, it opens like that. Elizabeth, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much for everything. Everything is just gorgeous. Just absolutely gorgeous and pretty. Thank you so much for swapping with me. And the extra goodies were just, were just over the top. And I really appreciate it. I mean, I'm going to have so much fun with all these pretty things. Thank you. Thank you so much. Happy Valentine's Day. Kisses and hugs. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye now.